Okay, so let's have a look at some uh, VM CPU and memory management with inside vCenter. So we have a number of VMs here. And so here is a Windows 2003 VM. So if we wanted to look at the basic settings and make some reservations for the CPU and memory, we can edit from here and then look at resources. So we can see here that we can have a reservation on the CPU in terms of the megahertz used. We can also define the limit as to the, the maximum that the CPU can actually use. And then for shares, we can define the priority of it from low, normal, high, and also to custom. We can do the same for memory. We can define a reservation and we can define a limit along with defining the shares. Okay, so we can see here this is the current status of our VM, the amount consumed and active and we can see there's no reservations here at the present time and this is the host memory current consumption okay so let's create a resource pool so with a resource pool we can actually group virtual machines together and have the same resource policy on each of them so let's select a cluster node and we'll create a new resource pool okay so we can then define the reservation the shares the reservation that's required the limit that we have again we can do it on memory and so on and then we can save that and we can see here that we now have a new resource pool from here, we can actually apply that to any of our VMs.